Alright guys, welcome back to the channel and episode number 16 of this Did You Know series as we take a look at 5 things you might not know in WWE 2K18. Did you know that the Great Balls of Fire pay per view arena has been patched into the game and is now playable? Previously in the series, we featured the hidden Great Balls of Fire arena which was found in the PC files for the game but was left in an unfinished state and incomplete as it was missing certain trons and turnbuckle logos. However, as of patch 1.05, Matty Winters 9 reveals that 2K have gone back and completed the arena which they now have added as a playable option when selecting an arena from the arena selection screen. Did you know there is special Thanksgiving commentary included in Universe Mode? This one comes from Benito Bird 77 who reveals that 2K have included brand new commentary in Universe Mode that references Thanksgiving when playing matches at Survivor Series. In total, there are four different commentary lines included as well as a special outro to end the show. I hope everybody enjoyed their turkey as we prepare to kick this match off momentarily. You know what guys, aside from my family, I can't think of two other people I'd rather spend Thanksgiving with. Uh in fact, I go so far as to say that you guys are like family to me. Uh, happy Thanksgiving, fellas. And let me take this opportunity to say happy Thanksgiving to all of you watching tonight. I gotta say, I don't know if it's because I ate too much turkey or if it's just Saxton's commentary. It's a good thing this match coming up is going to give me a little boost. It's Saxton's commentary. And guys, what a thrill it must be for these superstars to compete here on Thanksgiving. Especially considering what this day has meant to this industry over the years. For decades, Thanksgiving was considered one of the biggest nights of sports entertainment. And that tradition continues here tonight. Corey, how do you think these superstars feel about competing here on Thanksgiving? They should feel honored, Cole. As you know, Thanksgiving has a long-standing tradition of being one of the more prestigious nights on the sports entertainment calendar. What a great match. Thank you, everybody, for spending part of your Thanksgiving holiday with us. Did you know that Batista's machine gun entrance has been patched into the game and is now selectable? Much like the Great Balls of Fire pay-per-view arena that I mentioned earlier, Ricksong underscore RBG reveals that 2K have also included an additional entrance motion for Batista which features his machine gun taunt on the stage. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 290 pounds, Batista! Did you know that TJP has a unique corner reversal when reversing certain running strikes? This one comes from Banana Bus 859 who reveals that TJP has his own unique exclusive corner reversal as should you reverse certain running strikes then you'll see TJP evade his opponent and then hit them with a special neckbreaker. Did you know that Kurt Angle's current Daytrons are included in the game? This one comes from Gamathon, who reveals that Kurt Angle's current Daytrons, including both his Titantron and Minitron, are included in the game. However, rather than being assigned to the modern version of Angle, instead these are assigned to the classic version of Kurt, meaning you might not have seen them as using classic Kurt in the Attitude Era arenas displays his classic Tron, but using them in the current day Raw arena shows his new one. These updated Trons can be selected through creating entrance, where you can assign them to the modern angle in place of his ECW Tron and music, giving you Kurt's updated entrance videos to go with any current attires that you've downloaded. So there you go, that was 5 more things you might not know in WWE 2K18, I hope you enjoyed it and if you did I'd love it if you could drop it a like to show your support, as well as leaving a comment below to let me know what you made of today's features and if there's any other secrets, hints or easter eggs that you think I should cover. As always, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more Did You Know episodes and smack that bell notification icon so that you can be notified the second a new video drops. Until next time though, all that's left to be said is I hope you've enjoyed this video, have yourself an awesome day. And I'll catch you later.